Ah, uh, this is Westfield. So four or five times I used the stalkers in the house when filming. And then uh, driving out. As soon as I drive out of the driveway, you can see the corner house again being used. It's all about the timing. And yeah, here's my first location, Westfield. There on those rough park. And two days before, you could see me walking to the letterbox. You could see the stalk across the road being used, perfect timing. Then I showed you a few locations on that day. So we'll see if the stalk is prepared when I park right now. We're always park, right? The last one's here. Ah, no one's there. We're dead. Get on this car here. I can't see, but it doesn't matter. It's park. Alright, so what assignments get done when heading back. Completely dead around me, just uh, what that one car, the white one. Alright, so as you can see, no stalkers in position when parking, but you're gonna see how it's timed when heading back to my car. They're gonna double it and you're gonna see where they park, letting the target know he's on watch. And again, it's all about the timing. Keep watching, show me him back to the car. All right, heading back to my car, finish my shopping. There's a car parked right behind me, grey one. My car's right there right behind me so i'm gonna go around this way uh try to get a closer look keep watching oh, i just got out the car now she just got out the car now you think about that she's walking to the mall look at all the parking spots look closest to the mall before i was targeted they let me know i was in the program i'll park as close as you can every mall i went to but you can see this here. Why park that far? Right behind the target. Think about that. Red car in front. Nice. Think about that. Mustang as fucking well. Also Mustang as well. Car parking, red car. As soon as I get here, you can see the fucking timing. Again, why would you park right behind me? Right behind me, why would you park? All the parking you got right in the, uh, uh, next to the entrance. All right, red car just parked. Alright, he's not getting out. Stalker's gonna stay in the car. I'll ask all the time. See if he's got the time. Just to show you. Have you got the time? Have you got the time? Yep. All really fine. Relaxing, yeah? It's good, it's good. Bottom feeder. And the, his family members in India are stalking. This is worldwide. 
All right, so you can see how that's timed, letting the target know he's on watch. Now I'm heading to my next location to go buy my sauce, and you're gonna see how it's timed, missing brake lights. Keep watching. All right, I'm gonna go get my sauce. I'll park at the corner here, see if there's any parking there. See if they're open. Oh, there's a truck right there. Alright, I'll park right here. Alright, right here. Alright, nice talk is in the cars right next to me, right? <sighs> Alright, so I'm heading to go buy my sauce. Less than five minutes. Walking in, grabbing my sauce, walking back out. You're gonna see how it's timed, the red car, missing brake lights. Keep watching. See ya. Alright, heading back to my car, just quickly bought one sauce. My car's right there, you gotta get this red car parking right there. Alright, you can see the the missing brake light. Alright, you can see that there. Alright, you can see the missing brake light. Alright, freezing the video, zooming it in. As you can see, the middle brake light's working. The left and right are not working. And you can see the bottom right uh, is not working as well. So three missing brake lights, all right, as you can see. And I was just focusing on the bottom right missing brake light. Uh, through editing, I can see that there's more missing brake lights, the left and right as well, the, the major lights, right, brake lights, as you can see that there. So keep watching. I'm going to speak to the driver, and she says that she just got her car serviced, and they didn't manage to see the missing brake lights, right? And you can see the kind of excuses they make, but you can see how it's timed, like I showed you the last location I was at. Keep watching. I'll see speak to the stalker, telling her about her missing brake lights. Keep watching. Can you make this up? You can see how... Uh... Because now I'm just going to buy a, a sauce and head back. And you can see how the stalkers are sent. They have to time it. Alright, see if I can catch this one in his face. Uh, excuse me, you've got a missing brake light. Just letting you know. The right, right, uh, the, um, the right one. Oh. The bottom one. Oh, missing. Really? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Then you know, it costs five, ten dollars to change. How? From where? The left one, the brake light. Oh, all right. You okay, know what I'm, I'm trying to say? Yes. Um, the I'm, right one, sorry, not the left one. Yes, I know. I, I, I get, I, um, it was in service, not while, n not that long. I don't know why they didn't fix it. Ah, oh, it happens. Sure. It's only five, ten dollars. All right. Thank Take you care. So much. All right. That's a pretty good excuse though, right? <laughs> Alright, so now I'm going to show you when I'm leaving my house on this day, filming in the house within that 10 minutes and then showing you me uh, driving out of the driveway. Uh, when in the house filming, I think four or five cars they used of the neighbours being used in the house when filming and then they're going to use the corner house when uh, driving out of the driveway. Keep watching, show you me filming in the house within that 10 minutes. Keep watching.
<laughs> the timing, the timing. <laughs> you can see that there. All right, so I showed you two days before. The camera wasn't working when in the house filming. Uh, yeah, so I showed you through the security camera. You can see uh, the stalker across the road, the timing it when I was walking to the letterbox. And I showed you that at the end of the video, but then I showed you uh, at the beginning, right? The science being done, me heading to Harvey Norman's. And then I went to Sunshine, right? You can see the science being done there. And then uh, Kilo Downs, right? So you keep watching, it's going to take me 10 minutes like always. You can see as soon as I started recording, uh, delivery guy, right? Driving, uh, parking, right? Corner house. So you keep watching, it's going to take you 10 minutes like always. We'll see if they double it or even triple it in the house we're filming. Alright, this is a stalker that lives across the road. Take a closer look. I'll zoom in through editing, but you'll see his car driving in soon. There you go. Alright. Keep watching, they've doubled it. We'll see if they triple it. Alright, you can see the black car on the left, drive out the driveway, triple that, it says X, alright, alright, keep watching, see if they could triple it, alright, keep watching. Alright, fast forward in the video, and how do they know what the target's doing in his own house, the link's down below, the title says they can see through your walls, take a look at that video, then you understand to what you're seeing here, and again, the title says they can see through your walls, the link's down below. So as the video is fast forwarding, uh, I'm going to circle the corner house. Uh, you'll see, uh, I think, a grey car driving in, parking. And as you can see, there's no blue car there. Uh, when I'm driving out of the driveway, you're going to see a blue car parked. But you're not seeing it there now. They have to time it when I'm driving out of the driveway. Uh, yeah, so keep watching. The video is fast forwarding. I see it a bit late when the stalkers drive in uh, to the corner house. Uh, that's why you're not going to hear me sp uh, speaking straight away. I saw it a bit late, but yeah. So I'm going to play at normal speed now. Right now, you can see the stalker's driving in. Again, I saw it a bit late, and that's why I'm not speaking immediately, but I'm going to play it real time now. You can hear me speaking in real time. All right, as you can see, I just finished making my final cigarette. And you can see that there, corner house. So what they do, uh, five... I think four to five times they've used the neighbors who went in the house filming. You can see that there, corner house. All right, all right, keep watching. Getting prepared to put on my jacket, walk out the door. We'll see if they use the neighbors like you saw two days before when I'm walking to the letterbox. Keep watching. All right, fast forward in the video again. You can see the corner house being used. There's no blue car parked there now, but you're going to see the blue car there when I'm driving out of the driveway. And again, it's all about the timing. I showed you my first location. Westfield, and then I showed you the next location after that, going to buy the sauce. So keep watching and play at normal speed. All right, so you can see him uh, four or five times with in-house filming.
Uh, she may well have walked to the car and then walked off. Don't know if she parked. I think the car was already there. I'm not too sure. Can't remember properly. When in the house and filming, we can see that there. And like I keep on saying, wake up to my work to understand to what you're seeing happening worldwide. The last percentage of the population in each city worldwide are working for the state. So this is where I'm going to end it, showing you my targeting. But keep on watching like always. Government stage, false flag hoaxes, crisis actors, gun grab. Keep watching.